Hey guys, this is Steven with Lake Norman Power Sports. You can always contact me, Steven, at LakeNormanPowerSports.com or call me at 704-896-6022. Um, contact info will be popping our, uh, up right about now for the full details about how to get a hold of me. Um, today I just want to talk about the Maverick XXC. This is the 60-inch version of the Maverick, 101 horsepower. So it's got the, the heart of a Maverick, just on a slightly smaller frame. It's kind of like the Commander frame. Um, smaller, it's a smaller package really. And we got the 12-inch aluminum bead locks on it with the Max's big horns. Beautiful tire. Uh, octane blue, hyper silver type of color combination going on here. The X package uh, seats and all that. Analog and digital gauge in the front. TTA suspension in the rear, about 12 inches of travel. Podium, uh, actually Fox Podium 2.0 piggyback shocks. TTS suspension, so the wheel goes straight up and down, no butterfly effect. Dual exhaust, very nice. Of course, if you want to add a hitch, you can always add a hitch back there. In 2016, they actually changed the battery location, so it's not back here anymore. And you still get the, a nice link system rack right here. Beautiful octane blue. Gas fills off to the side right here. Four and a half uh, gallons of glove box storage. Let's get all this open. Pretty nice deep glove box. I have a little tool kit in the side. Handles for here, right here for your passion to hold on to. Nice and strong, built in, no flex, no T shaped rattle or anything like that. Beautiful Maverick XXC. And next, you have a XC version, a little bit cheaper, more basic model. Same frame, same engine. You got the front bumper, which is a huge benefit with the K amps. They all have that front bumper to them, so it's not bare. Uh, exposed radiator like other manufacturers do. Dual headlight design. Power steering, three different modes of power steering for dirt, gravel, mud. Adjustable steering. Adjustable uh, seat. Let's pull that and move it up, up back and forth. And these seats actually come out and sit around the campfire. Nice and easy. Pop out. Just a little latch down here you pull. Got a grab handle right here for pulling it out with. Nice textured right there for grabbing in. Beautiful X package seats. All right, we got the aluminum steering wheel, dual analog and digital gauge. Nice little animation. Let's see, one click is on with headlights on, one more click is on with headlights off. High beam, low beam, four wheel drive, two wheel drive, four wheel drive, so this go lock QE, quick engage. Sport mode, eco mode, power steering, just hold down cycles. Black key is your faster key, the gray key is your slower of the keys. Call the gray key the buddy key. And of course you got your gear selector down here. Go through all that. Reverse, neutral, high, and low. Overrides for uh, backing up, gives you full power in reverse. All important cup holders, of course. The grab handles, nice and sturdy. That's important guys. Ladies love that. Nice grip pads down there. Nice and textured. And of course this seat right here can come out to you, sit around the campfire. It makes cleaning up a lot easier too because you can get the seats out and get rid of all the mud and dirt, whatever builds up. Let's take a look at the front. Uh, yep, definitely mean Maverick front end to it.
So let's uh, put the seatbelt on. All right, fire up, do a little quick little ride. Push button start, very sporty fill. Put in reverse. That folks is Kenneth. He's the reason why we can't have nice things. And let's do a little quick little ride. Hundred one horsepower dual exhaust, dual in air intakes for the transmission too. She got some power. Excellent power steering, all done one handed. and easy nice texture with the grips and the steering the level of detail is phenomenal place to put your water bottle goggles and all that 12 volt plug So um, that was eco mode. So let's uh, let's play with sport mode. Still want to try to take it easy. I'm not going to do anything crazy. Um, I still want to baby the machine. But that first push of that throttle, I can I can hear the engine being different. It's it's a monster. That's, that's all I'm going to give her, guys. I'm not going to go too crazy. It's a brand new machine, brand new engine. Just, still just want to baby it, you know? Be gentle with her. Just nice and easy. The throttle is more responsive. She, she's got the... I just want to... She's got the... I, I just want to play mode. That's, that's sport mode, guys. I don't know if you guys were able to tell, but eco mode, it was much more tame, especially in the, in the takeoff and the kind of the top end to it was a lot more tame. Where sport mode, it felt like she she didn't want to let go. She just wants to keep going. Kind of the same feel I get with the <coughs> excuse me guys. Kind of the same feel I get with the, like the turbos and all that. Just want to give you guys a quick shot underneath it. Get this question quite a bit. And if, if you want, you can add a winch, it just mounts onto these right here.
already pre-wired for a winch. Nice and easy. Cable's already there. Liquid cooling system. Air intake. Air in box is up high. Air intake is actually right about, right about there, guys. These panels just pop off. Get to the air box underneath all this. Air box is right there. Look at cooling system. See so your master cylinder for your brakes. The engine is tucked up in there. Just like so, guys. Pretty simple. Mean looking machine. So guys, we're at a dealership in North Carolina. Give me a call at 704-896-6022. You can always email me, steven at lakenormanpowersports.com. Thank you, guys.